Alright guys, welcome to another episode of Floating Memories. Before I really begin, I just want to say uh, sorry for uh, no videos the past few days. I've been kind of frustrated with my upload speed and how it takes me 400 minutes to do what it takes others 30. But, whatever. And, so yeah, I believe I, this walkway is new. And that's because I um, finished my uh, skeleton spawner trap. I believe some some is dying by sunlight or something. I don't know. But they fall down here. Racked them in the stone sword three times. And bam. Arrows. Pretty much infinite. And yeah, I am happy about that. And mushroom stew is infinite. We have food over there. Plus a ton stored up. The tree farm here, the dirt above. I feel like someone's gonna attack me from behind. The dirt above is so they don't grow to be like the giant trees that take forever to chop down. They only grow that, so you can chop them down from the uh, ground floor. Um, I ripped down this house. I believe that that's not noticed. Don't know what's up with that. <laughs> And I just thought we would take down this Gladia Inn because we haven't before. Hope well, maybe something cool is in here. <laughs> the Endermen are helping me out by ripping down the walls and make everything bright in here. Awesome. Whoa, that scared me. Where did he come from? <sighs> up. Yep, they're up. So. Yeah, this is not well lit yet. Oh no. No, you don't, zombie. Okay, so I need some blocks. Good thing that creeper blew up some for me. This place is a mess. I bet that's an enderman's fault. Or just... Narrow hallway, huh? I mag imagine getting past each other. <laughs> Especially when you have to dump everywhere. <laughs> Another empty chest. Everything in this whole village is empty. Holy cow, a creeper almost blew up in my face. Okay, so it's dark enough that they spawn. There's another creeper. Oh, my, no, that was just the same one I didn't kill. Thought I killed him, though. Yeah! Good girl. Yeah! So hotel guests, the zombies and creepers. Yeah, that this is definitely Enderman. <laughs> What's up with that? It's probably because I spent a lot of time building here, so this area is loaded. I still don't feel safe. I'm still spawning somewhere. Over there. Here there be monsters. There we go. Let's put some Ah, oh, it's getting night time. Wait, where are they now? Outside? Okay. Time to check out outside. Ah. Oh, they could still spawn outside, like outside the walls. Yeah, this is not good. Um. Yes. <laughs> Let's 
Let's do like the spawning still because outside is dark enough for them to spawn in. Come on. Yes, yes. Pressure plate to help me out. Oh yeah, this chest holds my cayenne wool. Let's do this. Go to sleep. And then head off to a new area. Because we're more than ready. After they burn and I collect more arrows. Yeah, I like going AFK right here and just letting all the skeletons just like clutter the area. So I whack away with my sword. My hunger goes down so fast. It goes down to like two or three bars. And my sword completely wears out. By the time they're all dead, which is fairly cool. Um, we need more swords. You don't need more zombie meat. No! Ah! Oh well, I'll fix that. Maybe never. Never. Um, we need a sword. You can put this and this and this away. We'll need blocks. I'm antsy now that that creeper got me. Ninja creepers all over the place. So we have some blocks. We have torches. We're ready to go. Let's not take fall damage right off the bat. We should get more food. Ow. I'm leaving behind some stuff since my spawn is here. And if I die, I could quickly grab that and head off again. And... Fiero. I shouldn't sprint this, but let's get out of here. Let's take on some new areas. What's with this forest and letting monsters live? A ton of monsters. That was too close. <laughs> I'm not liking this force at all. Ah, get me out of here. This is not good. Let me build. Let me place blocks. There we go. I'm out of here. Almost. Okay, now I am. Phew. Maybe I should put my quick stuff in that chest, but eh. Maybe you should light up that forest. That's a better idea. What is in this chest? Absolutely nothing. Actually, I'll take the sticks. And let's go this way. I skipped the signs. Oh yeah, there are signs over there I have to read. Helpful tip. Let's go this way. Mobs are spawning all over the place. Okay, the grounds of fungus were very fertile, so that's why all of these enormous mushrooms grow here. They are making these grounds very dark and eerie, though. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Die. Yeah, and I've also been uh, playing Kaizo Caverns off cam. And I'm slowly learning what it takes to get through these dungeons. Which is not... Rush right in, like I've been doing. It's more dodge. <laughs> dodge the mobs when you're on hard. Okay, I need to kill that skeleton though. He's not... He's not helping my plans. Which is to go straight up. Yeah. We'll have time to check all that. Oh, not good. Stay back. Where are you? I'm not liking this.
Let's go up from here. Aha! So we're here. What's up? Looks like a safe way. I'm going up. Haha. <laughs> so, let's uh see what's going on. How about let's let some sunlight pierce through? This is crazy looking. I never experienced something like this. Shouldn't rely too much on natural sunlight though, because we only have half a day to use it. I'm getting mushrooms out of this. Can't climb? Oh, they can climb this. See, look, they do fly higher. Come on, om nom nom. How fitting to eat mushrooms still here. How did I hit the one behind me? Did you guys see that? Or he might have been in. Oh, lovely. What's going on? Ah, I see it here. Spam it. Fall through the hole! <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes! <laughs> See? It's not about how fast you can swing your sword. It's about how smart you are. I saw that. I saw you coming. No! Gold record! <laughs> oh yeah! Oh yeah, I like that. Still some dark areas. I should not have punched him. Okay, stop, stop messing around. That's another key thing to do. Purple wool, let's go. Purple wool, gold disc, success. Okay, we need a way to get out of here. Spider, don't mess with me. Okay, also a cool trick I noticed. 1.8 blocking does work. To cap the amount of fall damage right there. Oh, not good. I did not take that amount of fall damage right there. Time to run. Okay. Cookie chips over here. Bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Let's go. Bam. It's like these four up. I'm going to make this run multiple times. Oh, I was resorted to using lava lighting for like two hours. So you can never have enough torches. Relatively safe now. Well... You know what I mean? Safer. Let's see if I can't get my stuff. Should I be on the ground? I do want to see what's up with that middle pillar. In case there's anything there. Whoa! That was out of nowhere. Ah. My stuff, my golden record is there. 
I really just want to play the pew leases just for the golden, uh, just for the records. Who's that spider? Come on. Oh. This needs to go over here. So there's this. There's a spider. Good thing I didn't go resting blindly to get those free dirt blocks. Okay, so what else? Do we have everything? All my arrows, good. Purple wool, good. Tools, torches, good, good, good. Perfect. How many soups? Three soups. Doubly good. Yes. So. Believe I'll go to the next episode right here.